Hi, it's David from Game Refraction. I'm here once again at PAX West 2018 at the HyperX booth. With me here is Mark Tekhanov. Yes. How are you doing today, sir? I'm doing fantastic. So what can you show me today? Well, there's a few things. Can I borrow your mic? Sure. So uh, I would like to just, today we're going to talk about a few different things. So the number one thing is we're revealing a brand new keyboard in two weeks. It's called the Alloy FPS RGB keyboard. Uh, we all, everybody knows and loves the original Alloy FPS, which was a red LED lit keyboard yep. using Cherry MX switches, red, brown, or blue. In this case, what we decided to do is add a silver speed switch. So a shorter throw, so when you do the gaming action, 1.1 millimeter actuation speed, and also as we're using a Kiowa silver speed switch. So our first time using that brand switch on one of our keyboards. So you've switched from the Cherry to... Well, we're not switching. All of our other products are still Cherry MX. Right. This particular product is using the Kiowa switch. Okay. The, the second most important feature on it is the brightness of the LEDs. We're using a different style of LED on this design that allows us to go to a brighter level. So when you look at it compared to other keyboards on the market, very, very bright. So those are the main two points for it. It's going to be available mid-September. And uh, look for it. I notice it's very low profile. Like, like size-wise, there's it's, no... It's basically similar, to, or it's the same physical design as our original Alloy FPS. Right. So what we do is we just basically brighten it up and, and change out the switch types for quick action speed. Perfect. Second product we also announced just a couple weeks ago is our cloud for PlayStation. For people that are PlayStation players that want everything PlayStation Blue, we went to a licensed version where we anodized the blue uh, forks on the side of the cloud headset, and that's available now as well. And there is a new Pulsefire FPS Pro mouse, which basically, again, it's, it's the original design. We look, looked at and listened to what our customers told us, which was change out the grips, make them a little bit easier to hold on to, change out the sensor. So we changed it out to a new PixArt 16K DPI switch, which allows, you know, if you want to go that fast, you can. The standard 3 defaults are 400, 800, and 1600, which is what are typical for most users. And both the keyboards and the mice use our Ingenuity software, so you can change out the color schemes and save three custom profiles onto the mouse or the keyboard, unplug it, and carry it to your next system, and it automatically runs those three custom profiles. Uh, and, the, and the one last thing that's, that's relatively new or new for us about two weeks ago is we launched some new gaming micro SD cards for people that do a Nintendo Switch gaming. So everybody knows it's a small amount of memory inside of the Switch itself. So if you're going to be doing more than a couple games that are 25 to 32 gigabytes each, you need a larger micro SD card. So 64, 128, and 256 gig are the current card sizes and currently available today as well. So those are the new products that we're looking at today. And actually, later on in September, we're also going to be launching our Fury SSD SSDs. Fury SSD SSDs, yes. So uh, look for that. And again, that would be controlled by the motherboard itself. You plug it into their four pin header and it controls the RGB settings. So it matches the fans and the colorization inside the case. The SSD would do the same thing. Is it compatible with the Aura Sync and the uh, cooler? It, it's Corsair? There's, so there's, the, well, I don't know the second brand you mentioned, but the first one, so Asus, MSI, Gigabyte, and ASRock right. all have their own products. They're either apps or using the BIOS to change the color settings. Okay. So we support those four motherboard brands. Nice. So uh, look for it. We're, we're, uh, we're, we're building a lot more products out into the market, and we're expanding a lot more into the console side over the next couple months. Perfect. Well, thank you very much for your time. No worries. Thank you.